The Oracle NoSQL Database IntelliJ plugin can be used to connect to an on-premise Oracle NoSQL Database. You can get started quickly by using the examples available with the plugin. First, verify you have all the software ready. Make sure you have downloaded the Oracle NoSQL Database Java SDK file and the IntelliJ IDE and IntelliJ IDE plugin for NoSQL Database. Gunzip and untar all the tar.gz packages or extract the files if you've downloaded a zip package. Open IntelliJ IDE and install the plugin. Don't extract the downloaded plugin zip file. Instead, select the plugin in the zip format while installing it from disk. After you download the plugin archive, in the Settings Preferences dialog, select Plugins. On the Plugins page, click Disk and then Install Plugin from Disk. Select the plugin archive file. Click OK to apply the changes and restart the IDE if prompted. To create a NoSQL project in IntelliJ, open IntelliJ IDEA. Click File, New, Project. Select Oracle NoSQL examples from the Explorer window and click Next. Browse to the location where you extracted Oracle NoSQL Database Java SDK on your hard drive and click OK. Click Next. Enter a value for project name and project location and click Finish. Once your NoSQL project is created, you can browse the example Java files from the Project Explorer window. You must configure a secure KV store before you try to use the IntelliJ plugin to connect to it. If you haven't configured the KV store yet, follow the steps in the documentation guide. After you configure the KV store, make sure the KV store process is started and then start the proxy for your secure NoSQL database. Open a terminal and check if the KV store process is running. If it isn't, then start it. Then invoke the proxy using the HTTP proxy.jar command. You will now connect to the secure Oracle NoSQL database from the IntelliJ plugin. Open your NoSQL project in IntelliJ. Click the Settings icon in the Schema Explorer window to open the Settings dialog for the plugin. Expand Tools in the Settings Explorer and under Oracle NoSQL, click Connections. Select On-Prem from the drop-down menu for the connection type. Point to the correct SDK directory in your file system and provide the hostname and the proxy port in the proxy URL. Remember, this is a secure connection, so you need to give HTTPS in the proxy URL with the correct port number for secure proxy. Choose SSL for security and enter the appropriate username and password in the corresponding fields. This user should have read and write permission in the database. Point to the correct location of the trust file you generated when you configured the secure store. Also, provide the correct passphrase you gave while configuring the secure KV store and click OK. The schema is in the secure Oracle NoSQL database and there's a list of any tables that are already there. Now run the Hello World program. A table named Hello World is created. Two rows are added to the table and the table is then dropped. And that's how you can use IntelliJ plugin to connect to a secure Oracle NoSQL database and create a table, insert data, and drop a table. Learn more at oracle.com database NoSQL get hyphen started.